Well done, all you boys and girls who are graduating in 2016. Congratulations, and it's been a hard time for you, but you know something? you done it, you made it, and you're out of here. Good luck in whatever you do in the future, and come back and see us sometime. All the best to you all. Grads, it's been four years at Bendale, some of you five, some of you six. Uh, it's been a fun getting to know you. It's always fun connecting with you guys down the road. I have you, hope you have a great, long, healthy, happy life. And I hope Bendale's helped you out in some way, and I have been a part of that. God bless. The best to you. Wow, can you believe it, how time flies? Just a couple of years ago, you were tiny little kids walking in here getting all bubbly and now four years later you're still bubbly but those bubbles keep rising and you're moving on to the next stage of your amazing life so congratulations have fun and may the rest of your life be filled with awesome surprises good luck in the future all you grads and uh, go out into the world and be successful hey grads I'm sure you had a great time while you were here uh, the li your life in the future has lots more to offer. Uh, we wish you all the best and we're happy to see you come back and share your successes with us. And we hope that life brings you everything that you could desire. Hey Bendale BTI grads, congratulations. All your hard work, all your outstanding efforts have made it possible for you to achieve that OSSD in November 2016. Now you will be graduating in June, but we will see you back here in November for that ceremony with your family, with your friends, walking across the stage. Congratulations again. To all the grads, all the best, and as we say in the business, two to you and two to Lou. And remember rule one in life, if the shoe don't fit, move to a boot. Have a good one. Hi Bendel graduates. Uh, hopefully you have felt that we have um, supported you and prepared you for your future and helped you along the path. Um, I just wish you all the best in your future and don't be afraid to really go out there and try and um, make sure that you really go for your dreams. There's a huge beautiful world out there and we really hope to see you guys doing your best and thriving out there and making a difference. Well guys it's uh, finally that time of year. Um, I'm sad to say that I'm going to see you guys go and I wish you guys all the best. I love you guys and I want you guys to do the best you can every day of your life. Cheers and good luck. I'm only one call away. I'll be there to say. Well, it's another year gone. 2015 to 16 and you're all leaving me. What am I going to do? It's been a great knowing you all and seeing you all grow from grade 9 all the way up to grade 12. I wish you luck, have uh, confidence in yourself and you can do it. All the best to our former students here at Bendale, it's been a pleasure. I hate saying goodbyes and it's never going to be goodbye because I hope you guys come by and see us again. Love you guys, take care. Well, farewell graduates, you did it. Uh, some took a little bit longer than others but uh, Certainly a big difference from uh, seeing you coming here uh, in grade 9 all wide-eyed and excited and making it through your high school careers. Now you're entering the world. Congratulations to everybody and good luck. Best of luck in your new step in life. Enjoy it. It goes by too fast and I'll miss you. Take care. Bye. Big hugs. Uh, what I'm gonna miss, I would have to say, is like my friends and uh, hanging out with them and getting to know them. They've been there since uh, grade nine and stayed with me all the way. So. Uh, I'm gonna miss my friends, I'm gonna miss the teachers, I'm gonna miss the opportunities I get to do in the trades and work. I'm gonna miss the sports, I'm gonna miss the learning experience here at Bendel, I'm gonna miss the workshops, especially learning new things. The friendship of just it being a giant family and a bunch of friends. Uh, well, the food, <laughs> the the gym, definitely basketball. Like just every teacher, like every teacher is unique and have like different personalities. That's what I like about them. They're very nice. 
Probably the teachers and some classmates. Uh, my friends. Other teacher I've been to and the rugby team. I want to miss everything about Bendel. It's like a really good school that I've been to. Four years has been a good day. I think I'm going to miss all the drama for one and all the people that I've spent time with because everyone's always been so fun and just caring. Just the time spent here, um, doing great work, working in the shops, I guess. Well, classes, but um, oh, like lathe operations, got to make rings and whatnot. It's, it's fun work. It's fun work. Uh, one thing I will miss about Bendel is definitely getting to like uh, get hands-on uh, classes and all the great opportunities to get into like trades and skills. Probably all the great teachers and how it just feels like one big family. Up with it girl, rock with it girl, show them it girl. I'm gonna come back here for oh yeah. Uh, next year I'm planning on probably uh, going into like an apprenticeship for uh, woodworking or cabinet making depending on whatever I can get into. <laughs> My uh, stepdad, he's in, um, doing college for hospitality, so next year me and him and my mom are going to open up a restaurant. To get a, a full-time job in the automotive trade and finish my apprenticeship. Uh, I'll probably be working and then go to college with like, business. I want to become a welder, especially after I'm done here and get an apprenticeship. Uh, to become a construction worker, carpenter. I'm not sure, but maybe George Brown for auto mechanics. Next year, I'm going to go to Centennial College. My plan's for next year to come back here uh, and start my apprenticeship for welding. Uh, I'll be going back in to the construction union with um, Hardwall to make sure I get some more money and go back for my level two construction craft order. I'm actually going to be coming back to do a co-op and then from, uh, from there, I'm thinking of uh, going to college as an electrician, try to get my apprenticeship. So. Well, I'm hoping that I can get a job with a metal fabrication company I'm working with uh, previously in uh, co-op right now. And um, if that works out, then I could probably, you know, get my own place and just carry on with life. A little bit. No, I'm actually pretty excited. A little bit. But, you know, it's just that one big step that everyone has to take. Uh, no, I'm not nervous. Oh yeah, I'm nervous. Kind of. No, not really. I mean, I have a lot of experience, I have a lot of records, and I think I'm going to do perfectly fine. Not really. A little bit, but I'm trying to stay strong. I am. I'm a bit nervous, but I'm also excited for what lays ahead. Hopefully. Yes, I will. Friends are really important. Of course, I'm going to stay in touch with my classmates. I grew up with a lot of them here. I will sure to be in touch with them. Some of them I hope to, yes. Oh yeah, totally. Do my best. I think a few of them I will. Um, maybe here and there I'll ask how someone may be doing, but that's about it. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, definitely, because they're all my friends, so. The majority of them, yeah, I'll stay in touch with them through either like Facebook, hanging out, going to the mall, stuff like that. I would say amazing. Very interesting. Uh, fun. Very intriguing. The word I would say is definitely exciting. Interesting. Surprising. Impeccable. Honorable. No. Inspiring, yeah. Exciting. Very fun. Um, I want to give a shout out to Mr. Kramer for giving me a lot of experience in construction and teaching me how to do things the easy way and making it easier instead of harder for me. And Mr. Bevilacqua for also pushing me the extra way to uh, get my voice out there and not keep it held up. Mr. Zimmer is one of my favorite teachers. He's always been my favorite teacher since grade nine. I've been in his class every year since then. Kramer and Bawaka, but Zimmer is a good teacher. He's my, one of my favorite teachers. Shout out to Ms. Chalakis, Mr. Kramer, Mr. Bawaka. 
No, not really. Um, I like to give a shout out to Mr. Noble for being one of my favorite teachers out of like my four years of being here. Uh, some other teachers probably Miss uh, Miss uh, Miss Bernstein. I was forgetting. Um, and Miss uh, Miss Uber are probably some ones that come to my mind. Mr. Zimmer and Mr. Ball and Mr. Bowers. Mr. Lewis for always being there in Shop 20 and helping out 101 with me because that helped me out a lot. I would like to give a shout out to Pavalakwa and Zimmer. Uh, I want to give a shout out to Zimmer. He's the best. I want to give a shout out to Kramer. I want to give a shout out to Bowers here recording me. Um, any other staff members I had fun with, I'd like, like to say thank you. Especially Benoit, he left but he was amazing. Mr. Taylor, Mr. Paul. Mr. Akas, who's no longer here. Mr. Benoit as well, Mr. Kramer, Mr. Bevilacqua, and Mr. Noble, who helped me out as well. So, yeah. Shout out to Ms. Blaine. Even though she didn't let me go on the canoe trip, it's okay. She's a really good teacher. I mean, principal. Mr. Ball and Mr. Taylor for uh, helping me through the year and uh, taking me on some amazing trips that I wouldn't have gotten unless I came here. I'm gone. How can we not talk about family when family's all that we got? Everything I went through, you were standing there by my side. And now you're gonna be with me for the last ride. Let the light guide your way. Yeah. Hold every memory as you go. And every road you take. you my friend and I'll tell you all about it when I see you again <laughs>